how about you dean how how are you managing to reach out to your end consumers well, Stephen, first of all, I'm going to make a note and reach out to you when we start 2021 because we've not done much on the influencer strategy, but I love the idea with the price tag that you pay being, okay. you know, the Patrick Mahomes zero. I mean, that's mm -hmm. an incredible success story. And, you know, I was really wrestling with having a pretty clear vision in my mind of where authentically American, where I wanted to be, you know, having that strategy mapped out, but not having the resources. Mm -hmm. to go ahead and do what I wanted to do because, you know, after the Army, you know, I spent time at Procter & Gamble working on mm -hmm. brands like Crest and Tide. Spent time mm -hmm. at, at Mars working on brands like M&Ms and Snickers. And I still remember in 2002 yeah. when I was at Procter & Gamble, if you're familiar with the brand Swiffer, yeah. mm -hmm. you know, that was a brand that was launched there. And the year one marketing budget, the year one mm -hmm. marketing budget alone was $100 million. $100 wow. million. Stephen, wow. I don't know about you, but I had nowhere near that yeah. kind of money. So I was really wrestling with, okay, how do we make this come to life and really start to build? And, you know, one of the strategies was to focus on the client side, because Stephen, you know, this, what's so difficult about building a brand from scratch is you don't have an audience. I mean, nobody mm -hmm. knows who you are and you've done a phenomenal job with the influencer strategy. One Thank thought you. that I had, one idea was to leverage the earned media. We've got mm -hmm. this feel good American story. How do we get as much free press and PR as we can? And right. I've been blown away as a three year old company. We have earned far more, you know, earned mm -hmm. media, free press and PR than we ever deserve. And we had a feature story in Forbes magazine. Wow. We wow. have been on Fox and Friends twice. I've been on Yahoo Finance just in the last month. I've been on Newsmax TV. I've been on Sirius XM. So, I mean, just Fox and Friends alone, for one example, I mean, there's yeah. 2 million people, 2 million people every morning. So, you know, we continue to wide those coattails and how do we get that earned media out there so that, you know, people can still reference it. And that really gave us initial credibility. Because, mm -hmm. Stephen, I got words like, hey, Dean, the brand sounds great, but never heard of you. Mm -hmm. And then we'll show them this national media their clip and they're like, you guys are for real. I mean, you've been on national TV. So that was Amazing. our you know, page was how do we leverage as much free press and PR as we can, you know, given our feel good American story. Well, 